Hello everyone, welcome back to our channel, Learning From Home with Teacher Rosso. Today we're going to have a new lesson, main functions of some body parts. Let's begin. We have our eyes. The use of our eyes is for seeing things around us. Things that have different colors, sizes, and shapes. And of course, the beautiful surroundings. That's the eyes. Next, we have our nose. Our nose is used for smelling. Good smell and bad smell. Good smell like the smell of the shampoo, our soap, our perfume, our cologne, and also our nose is also used for breathing. We inhale the oxygen, the fresh air, and we also exhale the carbon dioxide or the used air coming from our lungs. That's carbon dioxide. That's for the nose. Next, let's proceed with our ear. Our ears. Our ears are used for hearing different sounds. It can be soft sound like mellow music, a whisper of a friend, or a tweet of a bird, a click of a camera. And also, it's also used for hearing loud sounds like the sound of the fire truck, the big trucks, the police car, the drilling of the road, and another example is the drum rolling. So that's loud sound. So that's the ear used for hearing different sounds. Next, we have our lips. Our lips are used to kiss and smile, to kiss to our parents, and to smile to our friends. It also helps us in talking together with our entire mouth. When we talk, we also use our lips to pronounce the words properly in speaking. Yes, okay? Next up, we have our tongue. Tongue is for tasting different kinds of taste like sweet, sour, salty, bitter, or spicy foods. And of course, when we talk, we will use our tongue. When we utter different kinds of sounds of words or letters, yes, our tongue also is responsible for that one. It also helps in swallowing food. Tongue is a muscle that helps our uh, helps push the food that we chew and then we swallow. All right. So again, the tongue is used for tasting and talking. It also helps in swallowing food. Next, we have our teeth. Our teeth are used for grinding or when we grind our food and chew our food that we eat. Okay? It will break down into smaller pieces when we do that. So we will chew our food using our teeth and then swallow. Our tongue will push inside. Okay? The entire mouth, like the lips, the tongue, and the teeth, it's very important. So, we have to take good care of our mouth. Next, we have the neck. The neck connects the head, the trunk, and the rest of the body. Connects. Okay? Next, we join together. Next, we have the hand or the hands, both of our hands. They are used to touch, grasp, grab, carry, and hold things. Okay? And also, together with the arms, okay, our arm helps or our arms help us in moving. When we do gestures, we do things with our hands. It is also, or they are also used for carrying things together with the hands. Because our hands is in our arms. Yes. All right. And we have our 
legs. Our legs are used to walk, to run, to hop, or jump, or anything that we can do using our legs. We cannot stand, or we can't stand without our legs. Yes, of course. We can stand with our legs. Okay, we can go different places using our legs. So, our legs are very important. Okay, so that's all for the main functions of our, but of some of our body parts. Thank you so much for listening, everyone. And I will see you next time. Goodbye.